Wow, Uzodima faces tribunal challenge and might be sacked as governor of Imo State any moment from now. Sacking things. Okay, my people, I greet you now. This is Verdict TV. Um, we are here to give it to you as already expecting. Um, governor Op Uz Uzodima. Hmm. Has been dragged to court, though. but as it is, it seems Uzodima is um, is a little bit winning. Yes, the court's case is gradually speaking in his favor. You know, as incumbent, it is still very possible because it's very very difficult to remove an incumbent governor and. Um, Uzodima may have, you know, be witnessing um, the challenges other incumbent governors that were removed were facing. So he will want to map out a strategy to make sure that he win no matter what. You understand? And that is one thing we must know. Um, my people, without wasting too much of your time, it will be very, very advisable that... Um, we quickly look into this very um, into this very content. All right, this is today's news. Governor Op Uzodima of APC has also been given the chance to face his fears as the governor of Imo, according to him. Following his victory in the November 2nd Imo governorship election, Governor Hope Uzodima is now confronted with a legal challenge as some contestants from the pools have taken the matter to the election petition tribunal. The Labour Party governorship candidate, Senator Atan Achono, has officially filed a petition at the election petition tribunal seeking to contest Uzodima re election as governor. Hiejirika Emeka, a lawyer associated with the Labour Party, confirmed Senator Achono's petition through a WhatsApp post. The grounds of the petition and the specific issue being contested were not immediately disclosed. Senator Achono, in collaboration with East People's Democratic Party, PDP, counterpart Senator Samuel Anyaun had held a joint press conference in Oweri where they accused the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC and security agencies of collusion to ensure victory for the All Progressive Congress, APC, governorship candidate, Governor Hope Uzodima. The PDP candidate, Senator Samuel Anyaun, also expressed his intention to challenge INEC declaration of Uzodima as the winner of the November 2nd governorship election in court. Um, Anyaun or whatever, all of them should just allow the sleeping dog to, to lie. This year's election is gone. It's gone. APC, if APC win a, uh, a, uh, a particular election, it is very, very difficult to win it back because, um, as it is now presently, APC has taken over the country hmm. uh, okay uh, my people let's quickly um, uh, let's quickly uh, hear from you on this and um, know what you equally think about what has just been revealed it is a pleasure don't forget your comments don't forget to to leave them below the comment section Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos.
Thank you.